Alright. Hit me with something. Like that. Hit me something that will get me stuck up on that ledge again. I don't think I can. I want to glitch my way up there and completely ruin everything. Oh no, not the ice. Oh. I'm not. I'm... Oh! Oh! Oh, come on. Yeah, not supposed to be up here, I don't think. Put the bloody ghost flower back again. Ah. Ah. Can I even get anywhere else? I guess maybe I can attack those when I have some other weapon later. Oh. Whoop. Oh, that's quite easy to do as well. Almost makes me want to try watching Future Armor. I've never been able to get into it. But then I've never really tried very hard. I guess I just kind of put it on the same level as Simpsons, and I don't like Simpsons much. Ah. Wait, where's that chest? Down here. What? Is it even higher up? Oh, I guess there is more up there, maybe. Whoop. Alright, what other strange things can we find up here that we might not be supposed to be finding yet? Isn't it just like animated by the same person? Or is it all done by the same person? Ah. Yeah, I guess so. Like a, a bit more. A bit more fantasy. No more freezings. Ruin my life. Goodbye, invisible ghost flowers. Elegant wandering maiden. What's that? Thoroughly explored while playing as Dana. Symptoms will ever end. How many seasons is that even up to now? Too many. Hmm. Oh. Yum. Ah. Hey. Oh. How annoying! Ugh. Oh, 
God. Well, at least it's not more episodes than the anime One Piece. I think that's in the, like, 800 or something now. And probably still going. Uh, hello? There's nothing here. Oh. Maybe I am supposed to get here later. Can you unfreeze me with that? Yes, you can. I don't know why coming here later would make some chests appear. Oh. Yeah, I might be around that by now. I think the, the manga's still going, at least as far as I know. So it could probably reach that point. Why well, I'm trying to attack the ghost flowers now. Oh what? Oh, Detective Conan is around a thousand. I don't know what that is. Unless... Actually, I might have seen some of that while I was in America. So maybe I do know what that is. Some kind of old live-action detective-y thing. Well, I guess that'll do it for here. I don't think I can reach anything else. Find that save or crystally thing and get the fluff out of here. Hi, Apex. I almost said Apex, but then I remembered. Oh, oh, oh. Probably would have been fine, but didn't want to risk it in case I have to do it all again. If you're gonna hide in there, I'll just shoot you. Hi, Infernal. Nah, not too late. Probably still got at least a couple hours left. Oh, now I have to climb up all this again. How is Apex and Infernal today? That didn't take long. Actually, I didn't even need to do that. I could have just teleported. Can I afford anything? I wonder if getting a level... would be more worth it. Like, why just get a plus three strength when I can get a level which would probably give me some of everything? Yeah, I'll just do that. Let's see how much it gives me. 472... Yeah, it gave me three point well no two, three five. It gave me five points of strength and three points of defense, so that was just cheaper in that it gives me stats in both of them instead of just one of them. And cheaper because it gave me stats in in a, a more stats than the other thing would have given anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you can just 
probably farm the level up items if you really want. Just get a bunch of the the essence fragments from the enemies and just reach max level. Probably take a while. But maybe worth it. What am I doing here? Hmm. Are we going to find out what happens? What causes the chasm? Because we're about to go down there in the future. is the thing that everybody seems to hate in RPGs. Oh. What the hell is this? Why are you so shocked? She's done this before. I guess that's a, a bit more shocking. Whoa, what? The whole thing has come up. Why is the whole building here? People hate grinding, but I'm weird in that I actually kind of like grinding. But only as long as you actually get some stuff for it. Like, experience and money is all good, but I also want interesting loot. Yes, if I remember correctly. I guess it doesn't even need to be interesting, but... Like in this game, you get materials from the enemies, so... So you, you're getting more than just levels, you're getting materials that you can use for other stuff too. It grew this way in order to protect the palace. Protected from what exactly? And also the series just has fun combat in the first place. Um. Smash! <laughs> oh, she just had a headache, nothing else. Kind of one of the reasons I didn't like Final Fantasy 13 quite as much, among other reasons, but like in that game, the it kind of limits you on how much power you can get. Wait, look, we need to go back and get the music. Like the the Crystarium or whatever it was called, you can only unlock so many things until some more things get unlocked through progression of the story. You can still build up points for use later, I suppose, when the stuff does unlock, but only when you're like 80% of the way through the game does the the freedom of leveling up open properly. any of South Park. I've been kind of curious but I think it's it's a bit oh this is open it's a bit too I don't know crude is that the word? Like I, I certainly do plenty of immature 
and probably kind of sometimes gross jokes in my commentary, but, but I think they go a bit too far with it for me. Where am I? Where are you going? Get back here. Oh god, the lock on. I don't want to target the things that are above me that I can't even attack right now, thank you very much. Rolled into it trying to get a... oh, a crotch. Trying to get a dodge thingy. when you can get overpowered. Ah. Like if you reach a boss that's a bit too hard and you don't want to have to deal with the difficulty. It might take a few hours to go grind up enough levels to make it trivial, but at least it's an option. to win. But I guess that's alright. If it's optional and some people have disposable income. Well, I guess it could be worth it to some. Kind of skip the grind if they just want to get to the end game content or something. Oh, nice jump. a lot of MMOs probably had it where you could pay somebody to play your account and get you to max level. I don't know why anyone would ever trust people with that. They could just steal your account. stealth is like in pretty much any of the Elder Scrolls is because I, I never use it I suppose but I probably just would always assume that it's a bit rubbish and broken like pretty much everything else in those games are is or something ah alright oh, I've got the thingy bling I've seen some Elder Scrolls online in the past, but that one's probably not quite as interesting to watch. Oh, and I did like a, a random little stream of Elder Scrolls Oblivion, like 
probably back in 2009 or something. But I had a nude mod on. So, and I got to that part where, like, you go to... I don't remember what his name is. Like, the paradise place where there's people running around topless and they actually had their boobs out. So I guess I'm lucky I got away with that. Without getting, like, a, a ban or a warning or something. Ugh. I think ESO is like as close to an Elder Scrolls game as you could get with an MMO. But still not not a good Elder Scrolls game, I don't think. I don't know if I'll ever touch Elder Scrolls Arena. Tempted to give Daggerfall a proper try, but I think Arena's just a bit too primitive for me. does manage to grab you this time. So that you can grab Dirk Ethos. No, he's mine! I didn't... Oh, I didn't open that one. Oh, looks like there might be another way into there. from unless the stairs over here go down but they wouldn't because the other stairs were over here up, upstairs as well harder to appreciate the other ones with their dumbed downness. Any other doors up here? Probably not. my first one as well. But I think the first one I finished was Oblivion. What was that that I just got? Life formula. I guess I'll be going back to town once I get the music sheet anyway, so I can hand that in as well. Just doesn't seem to be any way to get that other thing underground, so hopefully that's something later. Yum. 
Oi, where's the... Or was it upstairs? Looks like that one specific pot is missing. Oh, it is. Unless it's in the other room. No, that's this. This must be the wrong building then. In. Where did you put it, Dana? Silly girl. Is that just it over there? Can't be, because that's outside. Where's that? No, that's just where I was. Wait, is that it? Yeah, okay. Right, that, yeah, she was over there when I put it in, so no, silly, oh yeah. It even showed me her bedroom, so no, silly me, not silly Dana. an idiot I am. What would you expect from a derp... derp gun? Durgan. God, fatties take forever to kill. So, Yom, not her bedroom after all. Just a room. Unless it is. Hopefully I haven't missed anything, the chat's kind of moving. What, Oblivion people's least favourites? I think Oblivion is my favourite one. Alright, let's get out of here. Might as well see if the monkey's ready yet while we're going. No. What's that? Can I do that? No. from the past. Better appreciate it. Oh! 
I only sit on the most worthy of people. They have to earn the dragon booty. Oh, I went through all that effort and you can't even read it. Sleeping with it is fine too. Can use it as a pillow. Wink. Yeah, my thoughts exactly, Dana. I still feel weird saying Dana. Still feels like it should be Dana. All of this just for a side quest. They put effort into it. Unlike most games, but I think I ranted about this last time a little bit. Most games is just, go find this thing for me. Oh, cheers, mate. Here's some dosh. But this, you actually get scenes. Never trust a dragon. Smelly lizards. <laughs> 